the last uh, FDA approved combination for bladder cancer was in the 1980s and we really have had a dearth of new drug uh, development uh, and most of the most of the work has been in the chemotherapy realm this is a, a, a just a, a game changer this is for patients that the, the FDA approval is based on treating patients that had failed chemotherapy had very locally advanced in systemic disease with metastases in lungs and liver and bones and so forth and this has really been a game changer uh, uh, there are, while this is uh, Genentex, Roche Genentex drug, the PDL1 atezolizumab, there are a number of other companies, large companies with similar or in slightly different molecules. There's, uh, uh, so we're looking at PD1 and PDL1, there's PDL2, there's uh, OX40, there's TIM3, there's LAG3, I mean, there's just a whole uh, list of uh, targets, immunotherapeutic targets that we can begin to hit.